Hello and welcome back to the channel. Last time you told us in our Q&A session that you'd like to see our first ever vlog, which was filmed over four years ago. It was actually never intended to be shown to people other than our family or our friends. It's got nothing at all to do with Wizard in the Wild. Technically, there are all kinds of things that are actually wrong with this vlog, including the sound levels, so watch your ears. However, a promise is a promise, so much to our deep embarrassment, here it is. Hi, all of you. Wait a minute. Oh, it's not on yet. <laughs> <laughs> it is on, yeah. Oh, but well, you're going to sit with me. Yeah. Right, we got all crap bit at the start then. This yeah, is an yeah, outtake. <laughs> Oh, it's gone again. <laughs> Is it gone off? I've got to get the, oh, the shot. layout right, darling. I've not done this before. <laughs> oh, Luna, be afraid. Be very afraid. <laughs> Who's going first? Hi, all of you. This is Mum, aka Ellie. And this is Graham. This is our very first vlog. Started with a massive outtake. Um, I'll let Graham explain, aka Dad, what we're doing today. But I, <laughs> I just want to explain that at the moment we're still trying to find a name for our setup. And so far we've got Hard Nuts, or we've got Lumacomi, which is named after our doggies but we're not sure so we want ideas please of what name we can give to our travels and our adventures yes and today we are just packing the the motorhome up at the moment merv the motorhome we're just packing him up so that uh, we can head off to uh where is it we're going three cliffs bay. three cliffs bay that's the one yeah so we're booked in there just for a couple of nights so we're really looking forward to that and, and you've got to watch this space, really, and we'll send some more pictures when we get there. Yes, yes. See you later. Bye. Right. I'm still getting used to this blooming camera. We're also going to take uh, my bike with us this time. So I'm going to try and uh, fit it on the back of Merv. Never done that before. So uh, that'll be fun. Let's give it a go. Right, uh, we're only going to take uh, my bike, we're not taking uh, Ellie's bike, but here they both are, the beast. does well getting that in the drive. It's just about to come out and disconnect the electrics. Let's see him in a minute. Here he is. Don't want to be driving off with that connected. Not much room. If you wouldn't want to put on any weight, you might get stuck. As you can see, he's got a bike on the back. Wish us luck. Right. And this is what happens when uh, Merv comes out of the drive. bit of a mission. I don't know how he does it actually. I 
goodness, Merv isn't any bigger than he is. It's a beautiful day. Perfect for a little trip out. I hope they don't ever put bollards up there. Or it'll be a 3,000 point turn, I think. Inside the house, there are two very excited little doggies. Kiss a wave, mister. Kiss a wave. There you go. <laughs> Already. Come on, girls. Come on, in you go. Come on, up. Maya. Ready for the off. See you in a couple of days, house.
good bit of driving from Mr. Hard. Just arriving at Three Cliffs Bay down the skinny road. saying ice cream. There's the shop and the reception. The Pardon? You have to go in the rear. Oh, okay. staying for the next couple of nights. PO3. PO3. Apparently. And it's a glorious day. You refer to back to your on that far side there, yeah? Uh, on the far side, yeah. Mm -hmm. Two little girls in their pen who might appreciate coming out. Hold on a minute, darling. There we go. Yeah, that's nice, isn't it? You can stretch your legs. And the first thing to do when we get here is to have a sandwich. Have some lunch. Absolutely. Absolutely. And what culinary delights are we going to have today? We're going to have pepper jack slices for Graham. And I'm going to have smoked gouda. Oh, I like the look of that. Hello, Luna.
we're off for a little walk down to the down to the beach, down the cliffs, quite a long way. But hopefully it'll be an enjoyable walk. Come on Maya. Where do you want to go? Yeah. Let's go down this way. Beautiful, yeah. Oh look, I found a photographer. Photographing the wildlife. Oh, with the dogs anyway. <laughs> Don't get much wilder than that, do they? No. Well, we're a bit snookered here. We can't cross over the water because the stepping stones are covered. It's a high tide tonight. No worries. Yeah. You can just see the sea over there. And that's the three cliffs in the center. Well, the good news is it will be on film. Yeah. No, take my hand. Yay! <laughs> well, I was impressed with the girls. Yeah. Did they? Uh, did you manage to film them? Only, only one of them. Well, we're snookered. We can't get to the sea because the little river's too too fierce at the moment. We timed it wrong today. We can't quite get there. Not unless we cross that. There are some stepping stones further down, but they're all underwater now.
and now we're starting the climb back up the hill it's quite a long walk looking forward to it oh yes looking forward to my curry at the top <laughs> Yeah, it's a shame we couldn't get to the actual sea, wasn't it? Ah, it's a mission for tomorrow, I think. Yeah. And the tide is definitely in now. Evidently, it's a special high tide tonight. In about an hour's time, so still got a way to go. Good morning. <coughs> oh, the voice is gone. Good morning. Well, we survived a night here. I had to get up in the middle of the night actually to put the um, uh, the awning away. The wind got up a little bit and it was rattling around, so that was a bit of a worry. So uh, yeah, mind you, there's uh, a couple of people who haven't got out of bed yet. There's Luna. And Maya's been in that little corner all night. She's not moved from there. She's been a really good girl. <laughs> oh, breakfast now. And then we're going for another walk down to the uh, down to the beach. Likes the man's voice. Yeah, it works for me. Doesn't work for me. GoPro, stop capture. GoPro, stop recording. It's a bit windy up here. Tides out, as you can see. Well, that was a lovely cup of coffee, but I cocked up when I was working on the GoPro trying to sort out the uh, voice activation commands. I must have left it switched on. So the battery went flat, so we weren't able to take it down to the beach. So any shots we've got of the beach are from Ellie's iPhone, so um, which ain't bad. I think Dad wants to go for a swim, but we're very lucky he didn't remember his speedo. Girls! Girls! Yeah, it does. Come on then! No! It's lovely. The sea is really thirsty compared to that river. That was freezing. Oh, you guys look so cute! Yeah. <laughs> 
and this is how we get to the other part of the beach. I don't know if you can see, but uh, this is the way the dogs travel. You might wonder why we're not letting them paddle across because they quite like water. They've got the coats on because they haven't been feeding very well. So we're trying to keep them a bit warm. So that is the logic there. Really toasty, really warm, so nice. This is Three Cliffs Bay from another trip and um, taken from the same spot, the Milky Way at night. This is what I get up to when left alone at night. There's no way to service here, you have to grab your own plate. Oh dear. Good morning. Well, we had a nice night's sleep, so we're up and about again. And we're just waiting for Merv to demist. Hate to tell you, darling, a lot of the mist is actually outside. Well, there is a lot of mist outside. There was a yeah. one person on the beach today. It's pretty grim out there. It is. Been like that a few times when we've come to Three Cliffs Bay. Yeah. Anyway, we're just off down into Swansea to. Klein Park, see if we can get parked up down there and have a walk round. It looks as if it's finally stopping raining, <laughs> but we will see. See you in a bit. I think we know what that needs, a poo bag. We are Klein Gardens. This looks very nice. Looks like uh, quite a lot to walk through. I think that's where we are. Yeah, we're there. I think 
we can let the dogs off here, eh? I don't know if you can see it through there, but there's some, some toilets up there, all in the trees. And look, we found out where the fairies live. Look, there's the door to their house. Possibly. And there's not even an entrance fee for this place. Brilliant. Well, this is interesting. A little folly. But I think this folly, you can go up. I don't think you can go into it. Let's see what happens. I don't think it's very old. It's got concrete steps. Every time you turn a corner, there's something else. It's an amazing place. Really nice. Cool, yeah. Nice bit of wood for you, Jack Ford. I'll see if I can cut it up, get it in the car. I know. Lots of tiny little paths all over the place. Another little bridge. So far on our walk today, and I hope I get this right, is we came in and we walked across the Japanese bridge and we went up to Joy Cottage, which we thought were toilets, but they're a cottage where you can have picnics. And then we went up the steep path and we walked all the way around here. And then we did cross over 
down. I think it was a bit further up. You think it was a bit further? Mm. Maybe we walked up to there. Along here, we've, we've crossed one of no, the bridges. Not that one, I don't think. <laughs> but that Ganera or whatever, it's the thing with the big leaves. So I think we saw that. And then we were we were sort of crossing along here. But the main yeah, we came thing up is. Here. And then we came through the woods down to there. Did we? Yeah. So we went to this tower, which you'll see in the vlog, which is an incredible, incredible little tower, which gives you an amazing view. And then we've made our way along here, right the way to this entrance. So we're now deciding what to do for the second half of the walk. Now, what a lovely place this would be to bring Merv, to park him at the side of the road or something. It'd be lovely. Just, just park him over there, what do you think? I think parking here must be allowed because look. There's a caravan. <laughs> Hiding under the tree. Wouldn't expect that here, would you? We sound puffed out, we are puffed out. It's a steep hill. Ah, it's a burger oh. wagon. It has food when it's open. With a dog menu. Oh, look, you can buy a tennis ball. You can buy a tennis ball. <laughs> Poo bags, chewy bone. The touring dog, tea room. Dog ice cream. Oh, amazing. Nice lollies. Ah, oh, they're open on Thursday the 10th, though. Yeah, we're a few days too early. Yeah, or too late. Wow. Mm. Nice to see someone making uh, the best of an old caravan. Yeah, on a nice clear day, that would be a wonderful view over there. Swansea. Well, if you're still there, thank you so much for watching and sticking with it. That's great. I can tell you, Graham and I were really cringing while we put this one out for you. Also, while I've got you here, I just want to actually say there is a change to our schedule this week. We did, in fact, say that we would be continuing with our Aaron trip um, this th Thursday, hopefully, but we're not now. Um, in fact, something has happened over the weekend that has meant that we now need to change what we put out as a vlog on Thursday, possibly Friday. So it'll either be out Thursday or Friday, but it won't be Aaron. It'll be something else, which is kind of more important at the moment. Anyway, thanks again. If you did enjoy this, please do subscribe to the other guys, you know, the Wizard in the Wild chaps. We'd, we'd really appreciate that. And thanks for watching. You think that's all right? GoPro, stop recording.